Sometimes we make mistakes in our rush and quest to be in a relationship or to be loved and to love someone. This comes with its consequences when our eye is now clear and things seem not to be working as they used to be. When differences are hard to settle, when arguments take the other of the day, when keeping distance and not talking to each other becomes the way out, when finding comfort and solace in others becomes the option to be happy. God is never the author of confusion. He would not give you something that would not last or something that is not meant for you. You forced yourself into it and ignored the warning signs all along and it is now telling on you. It's not the end still. We have a God who is merciful, full of mercy and compassion. He would not cast you out because you went the wrong way. His arms are stretched out waiting for you to come back. God would give you another chance to find love again. He would help you right your wrongs. He is out to receive the rejected, battered and scattered. When you realize your mistakes, follow truly and God would give you another chance at love with the right person. God mends things. It is possible you started with the wrong person. God does not encourage divorce except on the grounds of serious infidelity and that is why you need to get it right from the beginning and hand over the relationship, home and marriage to his hands to help overcome challenges that may arise. Yours might probably be that you still want to continue. God can work it through, making it good or right from what seems to be wrong or not the perfect person. Relationships are a lot of hard work and not all smooth sailing. You have to work through your relationship every day to make it work. Sometimes due to miscommunication, distrust, infidelity or various reasons, your relationship begins to go sideways and you wonder if you are with the right one. You begin to wonder if you need to do more to make the relationship work. Whatever the situation may be, God will give you the chance to be with the right person. Here are signs that God is giving you another chance at love with the right person. New love. One of the signs to note that God is giving you another chance at love is that he puts and grows new love in your heart. This could be in two dimensions, either love for a new person or fresh love for an old partner despite previous issues. Genuine love is one of the reasons for relationships and the love that was not there before would be rekindled. The reasons to stay together and work it out would be stronger. The love would be stronger than the issues and the anger. That is the kind of love that would begin to grow. You begin to see a partner with value and affection. You begin to feel the pain of your partner. That is God working to give you another chance at love again. He has decided to mend things together for the both of you to continue together. You probably had issues or made mistakes from the beginning may be entered on faulty ground, but he has decided to mend it and give you love again. A relationship cannot work without love. The live blood of any relationship is love and the first sign or act God does in giving you another chance at love again is to give you back that love. Bring you back to the feeling of compassion and emotion about the person. We as humans, we like to do things our way and end up with the wrong ways away from the plans God has for us. Despite this, instead of going away from us, he decided to let love lead and came to die for us, to be reconciled to him again. So when you see love begins to build up again in your heart towards that person or someone else, it is God giving you another chance at true and perfect love again. You must have seen where you messed up or failed initially and are ready to give all it to avoid a repetition of the same issues to make things work. Knowing the problem or the reason behind why something fails is halfway to achieving success. In school, you would have been told that understanding the problem to be solved is half the answer. When you don't even know or understand the problem, what can you solve or what do you intend to do about it? You would remain a zero state. Another sign that God is giving you another chance at love is that for an existing relationship. He gives you understanding of what has been the root cause of the problem. God will give you the key to solve the problem with a commitment to wanting to resolve it for the beginning of a new relationship. He would teach or show you the mistakes you made in the past and how to avoid them with the new person he brought. 
There are laws to living or being with someone and when that is achieved, it becomes easier to stay together. If both of you are given insight into that kind of problems that were affecting your relationship, then that means you have a healthy perspective towards all the problems and are willing to take realistic measures to solve them. Figuring out the problems is the stepping stone to fixing a broken relationship. No one wants to be in a relationship where he or she is the one that takes the blame for any issue the relationship is facing. The sign that God is giving you another chance is that both of you are willing to own up and take responsibility and be prepared to give commitments to make it work again. He would show you areas to avoid and how to go about closing the potholes. It's a clear step towards building back what has been destroyed or avoiding it in the new relationship. He would show these to you clearly. You still see the future with the person. After giving you a chance at love and making it grow and also showing you areas to avoid or amendments to make, you would see the future in the relationship. You would see reasons to advance together with the person as there are many prospects together, assignments to achieve together. The need to be together grows as you see the future together, making achievements together. You begin to see all the positive sides of the person you never saw before. Whatever God is involved in has a future. It is because he knows there is a future in something, that's why he permitted it to be. If there was no future, he would not create another chance with that person again. His gifts are not temporary, but permanent. There are assignments to be achieved better together. There is work and achievements to be made with that person in the future. God knows your end from the beginning and he allowed the relationship to be rekindled because he has greater plans for you too. Are you seeing this sign or is the future looking bleak for both of you? It is God's will for both of you to love again. The future would be clearer now. Take a look at the relationship between him and Abraham. Abraham knew God had a future for him and Sarah and readily allowed Hagar to go and continue with Sarah. The future was good and great for both of them. God gave Ruth a chance at love with the right person again. He brought Boaz her way and they had a future together. She found peace and joy working on his field and not on someone else's field. It worked out well for them. Their heirs were instrumental in the lineage from which Christ came. If you can see the future in it, then God has given you a chance at love again with the right person. You respect yourselves and value each other greatly. Aside from love, future together and accepting mistakes Another sign from God to giving you chance at love again is that you develop respect and value for the person. Probably you took the person for granted, but now you have become more and ever committed. The value and respect for the person has been enhanced. You see reason for all the sudden changes and realization. Love can fade away, but the respect present in a relationship, it can be sustained. When you begin to respect someone and see value in them, it is God giving you a chance at love again to write it. No relationship is perfect without its challenges. The ability to work out the differences with the help of God is what makes it unique. The ability to sit together and settle the differences makes it stand the test of time. You may have probably missed it at first, but go. God would give you chance to love again.